yo 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 welcome back guys and it is your boy pal another with a genshin impact video here at game live yeah so right now the new star approaches and they were talking about like uh pretty much so much stuff that's coming out right now november 9 and uh, about the 1.1 update and right now they already have released the you know times in which the servers are going to go down and update it with your know, 1.1 patch and it begins at uh, november 11 2020 and that's 6 a.m utc plus 8 that's shanghai time so you guys just check it out and how it's gonna gonna be in your servers and uh it's gonna be around five hours and the good thing about it is we're gonna get 300 primo gems for it and obviously maybe subsequently if uh, they have some delays on the on the update we might have more primo gems <laughs> coming our way for compensation so pretty much uh, what are we looking forward to to the different kinds of stuff that are gonna be happening one is the new characters obviously tartaglia which is child uh, which is going to be like your Hydro Archer. Everybody's known about it along with um, the new banner that comes along with Diona as, as well as Beidou and Ningguang. And if you guys are going to be planning to, uh, you know, draw for that, draw for these guys, obviously they are going to be up here in the server for about three weeks time. And which after what, after which, you know, here comes Daddy Z, Daddy Zong Li. <laughs> Coming up with uh, obviously Xinyan and your boy Razor and Chongyun. So pretty much there's like uh, six weeks of time that you got like be gonna be like uh, pulling all of these folks. And there's also gonna be new weapons in the weapon banner which is actually like um, five star stuff. Uh, that one is like the Memory of Dust and uh, Vortex Vanquisher and Unforged. And all of these obviously are gonna be you know gonna be already in the weapons banner but the rate up um, items with it, with the banner will actually be uh, from what I from what I know the rate up would actually be uh, the the what, wayward uh, the wayward harp which is actually I mean sk skyward harp wayward harp <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be the skyward harp guys and you know obviously the skyward what well, because i've been looking at the banner and i was like looking at what the hell is that gonna be looking pulling for it was the skyward harp and actually the rust it's gonna be also there man i am so excited actually i'm so excited for the bows because obviously the weapon banner is all about the bows and you know they're definitely like uh you know putting that you know that that bow and child and Diona both child Diona so all of these things actually go hand in hand with each other and you know it's gonna be really really a sweet time to draw another one there are gonna be new chapter quests which is actually one a new star approaches which is gonna be pretty one uh, pretty much the one where we actually get um, a new fight I mean a free facial and there's gonna be other sorry quests uh, which is actually the monoceros Kaylee um, and um, another one would be the Historia Antiqua chapter that was actually like this is so much new story content guys and hopefully it's gonna be longer than what happened with Mona because with Mona it was just like Poof! it was done and there will be also new world quests which is actually very in uh, you know interesting and uh, world quests about like wow that's a, that's a lot like you've got like one two three four five six seven and eight eight new world quests that are coming on so pretty much that is very exciting and obviously the main event which is actually going to be happening uh from uh, november 16 to november 30 which is the unreconciled stars and i think this is the one that if you complete it with the uh, princess's pack to actually get the free official yeah i like that the gliding challenge, while well, it seems to be warm in events, will actually be announced in a later date, so stay tuned. So pretty much there's gonna, they're also saying that it's going to be happening. We also have another gliding challenge that's going to be happening, a gliding event. So, and also they're also saying about the reputation system, about that you need to be ranked 25, and actually you need to finish uh, Act 1, the Outlander Who Caught the Wind, and Farewell to the Archaic Lord to actually get access to this city reputation system. 
and there's also going to be obviously all the things that they've been talking about which is actually the exploration progress system in which they have like a percentage in some areas it's like you know it's the game telling you like oh if you don't have anything to do there's this like little percentage that you haven't done yet you haven't found us yet <laughs> you haven't found this thing yet you haven't got this yet so yeah there are the archive system which just shows pretty much everything that you need to know and about like uh, equipment materials geography and tutorials tutorials are actually very good for the new new people and obviously all the other character archive systems which just shows you every other character in the game and uh, and it has like the and it shows you which characters you don't have in the game <laughs> And obviously, other obviously other new content. Um, pretty much, we're looking at uh, yes. Uh, what do you call this? Uh, the one there is new recipes in the one min restaurant, uh, the Wangshu Inn, and um, is there something for Good Good Hunter? Nope. Uh, there is nothing for the the good, good Hunter, but there will be new items that are harvestable, which is called the bamboo shoot and a golden loach, which is actually a new plant and a new fish. And obviously, the new unusual hilly churl that actually drops primo gems. Wow. Hopefully, this is it. You know, like, way. And obviously, there are also new additions to actually our, uh, our settings, which actually you can now customize our controller and keyboard in the Paimon menu, which is actually tight. You know, like, people have been asking that, like, uh, a lot for a lot of people have been hoping that they could actually get that done customizing your keyboard because like uh, the drop the drop button which is X and the character character menu button which is C is actually quite close together and usually sometimes when you when you're climbing suddenly you press character and it opens the menu so and obviously you can now set your minimum distance and standard distances for your combat camera and default camera so that is going to be an awesome awesome addition and uh, look and also yes this is it man the weapon lock function and uh, the weapon lock function is also gonna be up and yes please do note that all the other stuff and all this other jazz is actually going to be um, you know it's all going to be uh, what do you call this uh, dependent on what time your server actually updates so please do take note about your server and what time does it going to be update but let's just talk about the roundup right now guys and what we're talking here is you know like if we're just going to be talking about like you know like if, even though like uh there's a lot of problems with the game just imagine that the company mihoyo is actually listening to the people so they ask for like a like a character lock i mean a item lock they give an item lock so pretty much like um, you know like it must even though it's not the resin system that we're talking about you're looking at a company that's actually listening and actually knows what the players are actually asking from the developers not unlike some other companies that actually don't give a shit about their players and just let them die to rot anyway thanks again guys for watching and hopefully you guys will pull whoever you guys want to pull and uh, yeah, it's your boy Paul again here in the name you playing Getsin Impact. Please do like and please do drop a subscribe. And with that being said, thank you again for watching and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.